Hey guys, what is up? It is Dominic, and in this video, we're gonna be covering Go High Level. Obviously, it's the only thing I talk about on my YouTube channel, but more importantly, I'm gonna be doing a complete breakdown of the entire platform, and it is going to be quick and summarized. I want people to be able to watch this video in 10, 15, 20 minutes, however long it is, and to be able to fully grasp the entire platform and the entire industry as a whole, which yes, may be easier said than done. Now, just in case you're new to the channel and you have no idea who I am, my name is Dominic Baptist, and I am actually one of the top affiliates in the world for Go High Level of all time. I also hold the record on the affiliate leaderboard for the most first place wins ever. Not to mention I've won every single award that the Go High Level Affiliate Program offers, which includes a Tesla Model X Plaid. On top of that, I've taught over 25,000 students in Go High Level, and I hope to teach a lot more in the future. So there you go. That's who I am. That's why I'm somewhat qualified to teach you guys. And for anyone who hasn't signed up with Go High Level yet and is still looking for an affiliate to join, well, you should definitely check out my affiliate link because you're going to get a couple cool things. Not only are you going to get the free course that shows you how to set up everything on GHO, but you're going to get the second course too, which comes with a complete white labeled onboarding. That means when you go out and get clients, you can just show them the onboarding videos. They're all taught directly directly by me, but they're completely white labeled, which means my face isn't in it and my logos aren't in it. So you can just use them as your own. And for anyone wondering about the updated 2024 videos, they are about to be live very soon. In fact, I'm actually going to throw you guys a sneak peek of one of the videos right now. Hello and welcome to the complete tutorial guide for this entire software program. Now, if you hop in here and you're still a little confused, don't worry. These video tutorials are going to make everything so much easier and they're going to make your business so much better. The first thing I want to break down before I get into any of the actual features of the software is the purpose of the software and honestly the purpose of software in your business in general our company does everything in its power to make your life easier whether that's using automatic text messaging which allows you to communicate with your clients and your customers automatically while being hands-free and then there's integrations having every single integration in one spot that's all your social medias your chat widget on your website your forms your surveys anything you could imagine even your google my business it all leads into one amazing place and for that exact reason you'll never lose another lead again and not only that we also have payment processors if you want to run transactions. Some of the best marketing tools on the planet. And reputation management, it's going to be a breeze. You're going to get more Google reviews than you know what to do with. But the most important part about this software by far is the service. Nobody wants to go out and learn a massive software program. And you shouldn't want to either. And no business should have to. And that is why we're going to help you with every step of the way. And not only that, we can actually build the systems and utilize the software for you. But don't worry, you will understand absolutely everything by the end of these videos. But that's pretty much it for the intro. Let's get right into the software. The first thing you're going to do when you log in is you're going to see something called a launch pad. And the launch pad area does exactly what it says. It launches you into the software. And there you go. That's kind of the vibe that you're going to get with these white labeled onboarding videos. They're freaking awesome. And they're going to help so many different agencies. And I am putting a ridiculous amount of time and effort into them. I'd also like to point out that you get a 30 day extended free trial with me. And I even have a brand new link that can get you a 30 day trial on the 297 plan, because usually you can only get it for the 497, but now you can get for the 297. So for anyone who wants an extended free trial, but on the 297, Congratulations, it now exists. It looks just like this. And I will be putting this link in the description below for anyone who wants that 30 day trial on the 297 plan. All right, that's enough about me and the affiliate program. Let's get into the video. So, to start off this video, I should probably explain what Go High Level is. Go High Level is the platform that I'm on right now. It is basically a complete CRM and marketing software system that allows you to white label it, which means that you can actually take your own logo and your own business name, throw it right here in the top left, and a multi million dollar software becomes yours, which means you can customize everything you want, including the prices. So for instance, you can now sell this software to small businesses for $97 a month, $297 a month, $497 a month, or any price that you choose because you can keep on changing this, adjusting it, and customizing it. Now, I must point out the biggest issue I see with new Go High Levelers is that there are way too many options. The doors are open so wide that because you can pick and choose anything you want, it actually hurts you as a starting business owner because you don't know what to pick. Or you get overwhelmed and you start picking hundreds of services to offer, and then you don't know which client base to go after, and your business fails. So how do we fix that? What's the first step you should do? you get into go high level? Well, it's form your offer. Get a definitive offer and service down. Most successful businesses that you deal with have a definitive offer and a definitive service that goes with that offer. Not 50 different offers with 100 different services, but an offer that makes sense with a service that they're good at. And that is how you scale with go high level. So for instance, as you can see, we've got a standard professional and a premium plan. I personally think everyone should start with these two plans and they should stick with 97 and 297 as the two offers. This allows you to not overcomplicate your business and overcomplicate things for your clients. It also makes things so much easier when you're defining your offer and your service. So I'm going to click edit details over by the standard plan. And then I'm going to go over to features right here. And as you can see, there are tons of different features to choose from. And this is where it gets confusing. Most people don't know what to click or how to form the offer 
or they just don't know what they're doing because they just got into go high level. They're so confused about the platform and they have no idea how they're going to sell this and use it for other businesses if they can't even use it for themselves. So my first bit of advice is to calm down. Just relax. Everyone goes into go high level the exact same way. Super stressed and very overwhelmed. But anyone who has actually put in the time and effort, I mean two, three solid months, will understand this platform like the back of their hand. Trust me, I've been there. I've done it. And I've taught thousands of students who have done it as well. You are no different. And once you understand the platform and watch the rest of this video so I can teach you how to understand the platform, you will know exactly how to form your offer. But for everyone out there who's still super confused, don't worry, I'm going to give you guys some examples of solid offers. For instance, one of the most popular features that Go High Level offers is being able to create websites and funnels. So you can actually create your entire software agency on the backbone of building websites and funnels for businesses. And if you'd like to do that, then you're going to scroll all the way down here and you're going to make sure that funnels and websites are turned on. And you can even turn off a lot of these extra things if you don't want to offer those services. Like I said in the beginning, we really want to define our offer. So the more boxes you have checked on right here, the more difficult it might be to sell or honestly just scale in general. But let me give you another example. Let's say you don't want to build websites and funnels at all. It's not your thing. You don't like doing it. It's time consuming. And there's hundreds of different services that you can offer with GHL. So you want to focus on one of them. For instance, automation and workflows. Automation is key inside of businesses. They need automatic text, automatic email, automatic Facebook messenger, automatic opportunities and pipelines. You can automate absolutely everything inside of a business. So why don't you form an offer around automation? That's honestly one of my favorites. I think it goes a long way. And I think the churn rate is significantly better because people are always going to be using that automated system. But let me give you one last example. Let's say you want to be more of a social media marketing agency rather than just a little software company. Well, you can do that too. I personally think it's a lot more work, but obviously someone has to do it. So you can come down here and click the all reportings tab. You can click the social planner tab and you can click the workflows tab. And that will allow you to see all your Facebook and Google ads or whatever ads you're running for those businesses. And then connecting them to the automation on the back end is just going to make them work that much better. And don't worry, I teach all of this stuff on my channel. And I even teach that exact offer in my second course. So just become my affiliate and you'll learn all about it. So there you go, guys. That's a summarized version of what you're going to be doing when you first get into the software, building that offer and finding out exactly what services that you want to offer so that you can scale with ease. But now the important part, how do you actually learn these things? After you built the offer, how do you actually learn how to do the services for these companies? And are there any other ways to make money with Go High Level? The answer is yes. And we're going to go through all of it right now. All right. Most of the time spent on GHL is going to be inside of a sub account view. So what does that mean? You've got the agency view, which we were just on. And that's basically all the back end stuff for your agency. Once everything's set up, you don't really spend much time there. You spend a majority of your time inside of an actual sub account, which is where you can build the websites, connect your Google My Business, your Facebook, run ads, pretty much everything is done inside of the sub account. And so that's where we're at right now. And that's where I'm going to start by showing you guys everything you'll probably need to know when starting a Go High Level account, beginning with the launch pad. So the first thing on the launch pad is the mobile app. You're definitely going to want to install this mobile app. It's called Lead Connector. You can get it on Samsung, you can get it on Apple. And how it works is it is gray labeled. It's not white labeled. It is gray labeled, which means it's not named after Go High Level. It's called Lead Connector. So technically it's still not branded as high level, but it's also not branded as your brand either. Hence the term gray labeled. But I've never had a problem with this. I've always told my clients to use Lead Connector. It connects straight with the software. It never causes any problems and they can text all their customers with ease. So definitely download the mobile app and make sure that all of your clients have it as well. The next thing on the list is Google My Business. Also very important. Every business needs a Google My Business. That's how you get found on Google. That's how you build up reviews. That's how you add photos. That's how your website gets found. Make sure that all your clients have a GMB account and it is connected. It's going to make your life so much easier. Trust me. And speaking of integrations, we've also got the Facebook integration, which allows clients to connect their Facebook business pages. And one of the main advantages of doing that is you can connect your Facebook messenger, you can connect Instagram, and you can connect your Facebook ad manager so that all the messages go right to your Go High Level account from all different platforms, not just Facebook and Instagram, but you can also connect LinkedIn, Twitter, TikTok, all of those. So that's pretty awesome and very easy to sell to clients. Next, we've got a chat widget, another very simple service that all clients need. Chat widgets are vital for websites. How many times have you been on a website and just wanted to talk to a human? You're tired of clicking around and trying to find the answer. You can just go to a chat widget, text someone right there and get a text back. Well, you can now offer that to small businesses. So I definitely recommend it. Next on the list, we have Stripe. This is for anyone who wants to do any type of payment online. A lot of clients do accept payments from their customers online, but either way you need it as an agency owner because it's how you get paid. So definitely connect your Stripe. You really don't have a choice there. You can use PayPal and a couple other different integrations, but Stripe is the best. And then down here, we've got Yext and WordPress. I'm actually going to skip over these. They're not that important. And I really want this to be a fast summarized version of what you're going to do when you get into GHL and how to build your offer in general. If you want to learn more about these, I do talk about them in other videos, or you can just look them up individually on YouTube. I'm also going to skip over the dashboard because once again, not that important. And we're going to go straight into conversations, which is extremely important. The conversations tab is where everything happens. In my opinion, it's the purpose of the software. We're trying to get leads. We're trying to get clients. We're trying to get sales. And how do you do that without talking to someone? How do you run ads without sending messages to people? How do you have a website without a contact us form that sends an email 
email or a text message when they fill it out. You don't. That's why you have to have a conversations tab. And I love the conversations tab inside of GHL. It might look a little confusing at first because there's so many different things that you can do. You can send text, emails, Facebook Messenger, Google My Business Messages. All of them are in the same conversations tab. However, it is so simple. Also, I see people get confused a lot on the unread, recent, starred, and all up here in the top left. This is just a way to keep everything organized. We've got your unread messages, your recent messages, your starred, which is basically like favoriting, and then you've got all your messages. You can also filter out right here by the assigned user, by the last message direction, whether it's inbound, outbound, the last outbound message type, manual or automated, and the last message channel. So look at all these different channels. This is what I was talking about. You've got email, SMS, Google My Business, live chat, WhatsApp now, Facebook, calls, voicemails, and Instagram. All of these different types of channels go into one inbox that you can either control from your desktop or your laptop, or like I said earlier, onto that lead connector app. This is huge. Business owners will love this. Having everything in one spot, they'll never lose another lead again. And that's your pitch. Next on the list is calendars. Obviously, businesses use calendars. They use appointments. They have reminders. There is nothing too fancy about the Go High Level calendar system. You can pretty much build any type of calendar or appointment widget that you want. And once again, if you want to learn exactly how to do that, I have videos on it. All of these features have videos on how to do them exactly. The important thing is knowing your offer and what you should learn. Most people get overwhelmed because they want to learn everything inside of GHL. And I'll be honest, that's what I did when I first started. I learned absolutely everything, but I only used like 10% of it. So why don't you cut out the rest of the 90%, learn the 10%, and you'll save yourself a ton of time and a lot of effort. And you'll be hyper-focused on skills that you'll use forever. In my opinion, calendars are important and it's nice to know how to use them, but they're not going to make or break your business. Now let's go to contacts. Contacts are important because how are you going to run a business without having contacts? You need them, your clients need them, everyone needs them. And you have an import and export button right here. If you already have contacts somewhere else on like an Excel spreadsheet, you can just import them all into the system and send out mass email or mass text messages. You can also add them to workflows, which means I could take every single contact that I have and send them into an automatic text follow-up campaign. This is unbelievably powerful. Following up with leads is the number one way to close leads. Most people will send out one message or one cold call or one anything, and then they're done. They give up. They didn't get the sale, so they quit. It can take up to seven or eight follow-up messages just to get a response out of someone, let alone close the deal. Following up matters. Next on the list is opportunities. Now, once again, if you want to learn opportunities and pipelines, I've made an entire video on these things. So just go on my YouTube channel and you'll find it. But basically what opportunities and pipelines do is they allow you to organize and manage all of your clients and all of your leads. As you can see, you can put in the contact name, their email, their phone, their opportunity name, their pipeline, which stage in the pipeline are they in, their status, are they an open lead? Are they a lost lead? Are they a one lead? Or are they an abandoned lead? And you can even put in the opportunity value. So for instance, let's say the lead is worth $10,000, then you can put in $10,000. And then if you ever close that customer, that $10,000 value will be added to your dashboard so you can see how much money you're making. Pretty cool. In my opinion, it's not make or break. I think the contacts tab, the conversations tab, and the automations tab are way more important, but we'll get to that in a second. Next on the list is payments. So if you're doing anything with online transactions at all, you're going to be spending a lot of time in here. For instance, we've got invoices, documents, and contracts. We've got orders, subscriptions, payment links, transactions, products, and even coupons. I'd also like to take you over to the integrations tab where you can connect your Stripe account, or you can scroll down here and connect your PayPal account. And we even have two other options, authorized.net and NMI, because obviously not everybody has Stripe or PayPal. And if you want to see a full breakdown of payments and products, I actually just made that video recently. So once again, check the YouTube channel. I got a lot of good stuff in there. Next, let's break down the marketing tab. Now, if I'm being honest, I run a lot of my marketing through Facebook ad manager. I don't necessarily use the marketing tab inside of GHL, but if you want to use it, you can actually connect all of your social medias. So for instance, I'll click ad account. We've got Google My Business, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, Twitter, or X, and even TikTok. You can connect all of these accounts for all of your clients. And then you can make posts inside of Go High Level. Not only that, we've got email templates and text message templates. And here's something that's pretty cool, the affiliate manager. So this allows you to create your own affiliate program. Let me give you an example. Let's say one of your best offers is a $297 offer. And of course that's per month. Well, you can go to your clients who are on that 297 offer and say, hey, if you know other small businesses that would love this, I will create an affiliate campaign and an affiliate link for you that will give that client a commission for every client that they bring in. So you could basically create a team out of your clients to go get you more clients. And you can either do a one-time commission or you could do a monthly recurring commission where they get paid every single month. As one of the top affiliates in the world for Go High Level in general, I can assure you that affiliate programs are one of the best business models ever. They are so powerful and they absolutely rake in money. So I highly recommend building your own affiliate business. And next on the list is automations. This is probably the most important thing inside of Go High Level 
ever. Automations are everything inside of a business. How you run the calendars and appointments is done inside of automation. How a website actually functions is done inside of automation. How you do follow-up campaigns. They are all done inside of this automation tab in something called workflows. Now workflows are going to scare all of you in the beginning. You're going to click over here on create workflow and you're either going to start from scratch or you're going to pick one of the options that they already have for you. I highly recommend starting from scratch every single time. That way you're not confused and you can build out any workflow that you want. But the most important thing to know about building workflows is keep them simple. You're going to see a lot of photos of workflows that are just massive, have hundreds and hundreds of different actions, and they look like a giant Christmas tree diagram, and they just go on forever and ever. And yes, sometimes businesses need workflows that are that big and that crazy. But in the beginning, just focus on short and concise workflows. Let me give you an example. So every workflow starts with a trigger event. Something has to trigger all of these other events to occur. So let's check out some of these trigger events. We've got a ton of different options to choose from. Once again, don't get overwhelmed. I've got a bunch of videos on this. Go watch my workflow videos. They will calm you down. They'll make you feel much better. But let me find a simple one for you. One of the most commonly used workflow triggers is form submitted. You know, when you go on a website and you see a form pop up and you put in your information, that's exactly what this is. As soon as you submit that form, that's the trigger event. So let's save the trigger event. And now that we've done that, we can choose the action. What do we want to happen when someone fills out the form? Well, usually I'd like to send a text message to that person. So let's do that. I'm going to type in SMS and we're going to send an SMS and we can type in anything that we want. I said, thanks for filling out the form. Nice, simple little message. And we're going to click save action. And there you go. Now, when someone fills out the form that we go create, they're going to get a text message that thanks them for filling out the form. And if you wanted to create a follow-up sequence, you click plus again, you type in wait, and then you choose the duration of time of how long you want to wait. So let's do one day, save the action. And then I'm going to copy this one. And then I'm going to click these three little dots over by SMS. I'm going to copy it, copy the action here, and I'm going to paste it under the wait time. So guess what we just did? We created a follow-up campaign and we did it in like 30 seconds. But of course we want to change what we say in the second message. So I'll say something like, are you still interested? Question mark. And then I will save the action. And there you go. That is a follow-up campaign. Could not be simpler. Don't overwhelm yourself. It's not that hard. And that brings us to the next tab, which is sites. Now websites and funnels are extremely important and there are tons of different templates to choose from. So you're going to click on new funnel and we're going to go check out some of these templates. And here you go. Look at how many there are. We've got weight loss consultant, Brazilian jujitsu cancellation, wellness center, car guru. The list goes on and on and on. Let's check one of these out. All right. This funnel is for a DJ. Let's click the little eyeball icon and we can actually see a preview of the funnel right here. And if we like it, we can just use it. And then we can edit all the photos, edit all the text, and we can actually go sell that to a business owner. That's pretty awesome. Once again, if you want to learn how to do this very in depth, I have multiple videos on my channel that cover how to build websites and funnels. This is something that you definitely want to learn. Remember when I told you about that 90%, 10%, the 10% of go high level you need to learn? Well, funnels and website building, that is in the 10%. So I highly recommend taking some time and learning how to build websites and funnels. You'll thank me later. You also have the option for blogs, WordPress integration if you'd rather use WordPress, a client portal, which helps you create courses. We've got forms and surveys, which you're going to build for clients, mostly forms. And then of course, we've got the chat widget that I talked about earlier, where you can actually customize the entire chat widget and then add it to any website that you'd like. Next, I'm going to skip down here to reputation. This is basically reputation management, helping your clients get more Google reviews and Facebook reviews. Nothing too crazy complicated in here. Just know that it exists and you can offer it as a service. And then the last thing I'm going to cover is the reporting tab where you can integrate your Google ads and your Facebook ads. And you can see all the analytics right here inside of GHL. Pretty awesome. And if you want to run more of an SMMA style, this will come in handy. But there you have it, guys. I want to do a quick little summarized version. And honestly, that's pretty much it. If you knew how to do a fraction of the things I covered today, you could run a successful agency. Not only that, there are other ways to make money with Go High Level. For instance, you can start your own own business. I have my own land clearing and excavation business and I run it completely through GHL. We did $400,000 in revenue last year and we're a brand new business. It was completely built on the backbone of Go High Level and I could not be more proud of that. Or maybe you want to be an affiliate leader like me. As you can see, I'm on my affiliate leader dashboard where I have reached the highest achievement you can possibly reach, the high level commander three, which means you've made over $2 million with Go High Level affiliate program. Right here at the top, you can see I've collected $2,385,778.19. So yes, I'm a little over the 2 million mark and I've even got the trophy to prove it. And how the affiliate program works is I get paid to teach other people Go High Level. So when I make all these videos like the one I'm doing right now, new entrepreneurs will use my link and Go High Level will pay me 40% monthly commission for bringing in those new users. Obviously, 40% monthly commission starts to stack up and up and up. And that leads to making hundreds of thousands of dollars every single month. So yeah, it's not a bad gig. And I actually have an entire course based on the affiliate program alone. Now I will point out it's very difficult to get into this course because to be an affiliate leader, you have to know Go High Level extremely well and you better be good at content 
content creating and good at teaching. This is not a walk in the park. I did not make nearly two and a half million dollars by being lazy and just making a couple videos. Trust me, I wish it was that easy. So I only give out my affiliate course to people that have earned it. People that have shown time and time again that they're successful with Go High Level and they're ready to teach it to others. And if you think you're one of those people, reach out to me on Facebook or Instagram and I'll let you know if you are. But this video is mostly for people who are just getting started with Go High Level. So I don't want to overwhelm you with all these crazy things about the affiliate program and starting your own business. I just want you to learn Go High Level. And that's what I'm good at. I'm good at teaching newcomers how to use GHL. So if you're one of those newcomers, use the link in the description below, reach out to me on Facebook or Instagram, and I'll make sure you get everything you need to get set up and start crushing with Go High Level. And if you want a little head start, check out the link in the description below, completely free course, which shows you how to set up absolutely everything and how to become my affiliate. And once again, all my affiliates are going to get that second course, which is about to have an entirely updated white label onboarding to make sure all your clients get set up as smooth as possible. But that's pretty much it for the video. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.